The Ethiopian airline has called upon Kenyan airline KQ to partner in joint procurement of aircraft equipment and lower the cost of operation. Ethiopian Airline Strategic Planning and Alliance Vice President Enoch Tefera said this was one way the airlines will increase return in capital and have a strategic position in African routes that are dominated by Turkish Airlines and Emirates. Ethiopian Airline is currently the Africa's largest in revenue and profit and has overtaken Dubai as a conduit for long-haul passengers to Africa under its strategic expansion plans. This is all for survival. African market is fragmented and this integration would be important to raise the market share to compete with Asia-Pacific, Europe and America carriers at 50-50% share, Tefera said. In the connectivity solutions, Tefera said that the airlines would also liaise in training of crew. This is despite Kenya having signed in October an agreement with Federation Aviation Authority in Washington, D.C. to train aviation professionals at the East African School of Aviation ESA. A report by International Air Transport Association IATA released early this year showed that African Airlines received a 7.5% increase in traffic in 2017 compared to 2016. The international passenger capacity rose by less than half the rate of demand at 3.6%, and load factor jumped 2.5% to 70.3%. Asia-Pacific posted annual demand growth of 9.4%, over the same period driven by robust regional economic expansion and an increase in route options for travelers. In a similar report by the Global Association released in June, placed 20% control in travel by the African airlines in the continent compared to 80% by foreign airlines. The airlines were able to maximize benefits from reduced oils prices and fares, 